Hi everyone. Okay, it's been a while since I've done a video because I'm still learning this YouTube world out there. Um, some of you might know I'm pushing 60, so anything like this is um, a giant step. It's not a baby step for me, it's a giant step. So anyway, I'm a reseller with new children's clothes. I go to garage sales, liquidation sales, end of season sales, second hand shops, you name it. But everything I get has a tag on it, has to be new. So this is what I've sold this week. <coughs> Excuse me everyone. So it's Wednesday here in Australia and this is what I've sold. So that dress first off, $10.00. Bought that for 50 cents. Now, I bought a heap of them. A lady made them up. She made them up and she gave them to a second-hand shop. She must have just gave them because, as I said, I bought them all for a dollar each. Um, here's another one, the purple one, which is sold. This one is sold, which she also made. I think she does it as a hobby. I don't know, but... I fluke so many dresses. So all these dresses are going out. They're $10 each. This one, $10. Um, I think when she doesn't have enough material, she uses the lace, which is quite effective. So for a little summer dress, which Australia is now coming into us in, $10. They're flying out the door. So that one's sold and that one's sold. These two have sold. Now this one, this one I bought at the op shop, it's got a label, it's got a tag, I added the hairband. So sometimes I will get a hundred hairbands um, for probably $10 online and I add them to clothes which will put the price up. So I sold this, this is a Christmas outfit, well I called it a Christmas outfit. It's got the tulle. It's absolutely beautiful. Not a mark on it. Sold that yesterday for 15 That's a pickup. The other's a postage, so she's actually coming to pick that up. I sold this this morning. Got that at the op shop. It's a pretty little one. I actually had a few of them. I got them online. Actually, I think I just said op shop. I got them on online. Um, and I had to buy 20 of them and it worked out, I think, 75 cents each. I sold them for $10 each and that's the last one and that just sold. Uh, this one's going out. The rabbit, same deal. Same deal, 75 cents each. Last one, bought 20 of them. Uh, there is a place uh, I buy a lot of my stock you are you don't know your sizes that you get uh, you can't see your colors but normally it's the one color which this was and so was this um, but you don't know your sizes uh, I usually get around about the size 2 to size 6 that I've never really got over a size 6 so um, that's the way it is. Now this one, this one just sold, that one, $20. But look, it is beautiful. It's got the tartan around the bottom. Now I do have two of them. And that one sold for $20. That's a size four. Um, that was, uh, that is also a pickup. So some, I do it on the Facebook pages and people pick up. Uh, I got the unicorn bag, see, new, it's a lunchbox, unicorn, I got that at a department store for 20 cents, I sold that for six dollars. Uh, the Peppa Pig thongs, as you can see, brand new, once again, 20 cents, sold them for three dollars fifty, because I don't believe you should spend over that on a child. The Monster High bag. Five dollars, sorry, sorry, two dollars, and I sold it for ten dollars. Did have fifteen, but I took um, an offer of ten. 
so um, I will take offers. What else sold? I think over here, yes. Um, none of the baby stuff is over a dollar that I've bought. Over a dollar. I am selling out the baby stuff, everything five dollars. So I've sold that one, and that one, and that one, that one. They went yesterday. That one, that one, that, that, that. All of them up to the boys. So this lot is going to the one person. That was $5 per item. She is actually coming to pick up tonight and pay in cash. So that is my update. Um, I haven't put the Dora clock out there yet. I may leave it a little closer to um, Christmas for that. These, I get an abundance of these. Um, I've had probably over 30, 50 Fisher-Price ones. These are all Fisher-Price. Um, I get them for about a dollar. Now, some come in boxes, some don't. But as you can tell, that's new. No baby has dribbled or draw or, or done anything to this. This is perfect condition. So I sell them for 10. They sell for around about the $40 mark. That is the large one. So, um, yeah, so that's it. Um, now, I did get this dump truck. So if anyone can help me out there in YouTube world, see the dump truck. Great, a great deal. Brand new. Didn't come with the dump truck. Apparently, there's a little garbage bin that sits on there, and when you turn it on, it goes up and empties in into that slot there. If anyone can tell me where I can get it, or if they could sell me one, because this is a great buy, but not without the garbage. So, if anyone can help me out, thank you very much. Okay, please subscribe and share. I I don't know how to get people to subscribe and come and view my things and I'll answer anything. I like the Cincinnati picker. I like um, Locker Nuts. Locker Nuts, wonderful guy. If you want to watch something that is actually genuine, watch Locker Nuts. He will tell you when he fails and he'll tell you when he, he's up there. Him and his wife, you don't see his wife a lot, but um, she's always there in the background somewhere, probably running the show as a woman does. Um, but anyway, lock of nuts. Get in there, have a look. Cincinnati Picker, he's really good too. There's so many resellers out there. And then we need to join forces. We need to help each other out, share each other's page and get it out there. We're all in the same boat. I'm from Australia. I'm not going to be treading on Cincinnati pickers or locker nuts. I think they're in California. Could be wrong. But whatever, I'm not treading on their toes. They're not going to be treading on mine. So let's, let's help each other out. So thanks, everyone. And uh, I'll try to get more and more videos out. Thank you.